Here's my first side panel that I have put on. I decided to go with um, regular carbon fiber just because of how tough it was to cut that Kevlar um, when it was wet. And uh, these pieces are easier to apply when they're wet. Um, in large sections like this, at least it was for me, when I don't have extra hands. Um, because it allows you to to kind of pick it up and, and reapply and reposition it if you need to. Um, otherwise, uh, if you do it trying to put the fibers on dry with a a sticky undercoating, once those fibers stick to that, then it'll want to snag. If you try and pick it back up and and reposition it, and it's just not. Uh, not ideal for a single person. <clears throat> um, if anyone's wondering what this process is like to put this peel ply on, and you can do it whether your carbon is applied dry or wet. If you apply it dry and then you let it cure underneath to stick, and then you brush your resin into your fibers, into your carbon, and then afterwards you put your peel ply on top of it and you'll see the the resin starting to seek through um, the peel ply it'll start to get wet and so what you want to do is take some extra resin dip your brush in that resin and then brush a little bit of it on because you want to you want to wet it out and then once you brush a little bit on, you dab it. You just keep dabbing it. Dab, 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 dab. And you just keep doing that until it completely soaks through the entire uh, peel ply. And that's what that's doing is that's making a solid contact with that carbon, giving you, once you peel this peel ply off, it's gonna give you that nice flat surface so that when you're applying your resin then, you don't have all of these bumps over the place that you have to sand out and then reapply and then sand out and reapply it just it, it's it's shifting work from one thing to another so instead of working at sanding constantly which um you know maybe some people are okay with this is just dabbing this on and I, and personally i think this takes less work um than all of the sanding all the sanding and everything i think takes more time um but it's just another way of doing things, and in my opinion, this is the better way to do it because, like I said, it, it ensures a nice flat surface of your carbon for applying your top coats.